Hello, I'm Mark Victory here at ISIS in London and I'm with Rob Peacock from ISIS Consulting, one of our consultants, and we're going to be discussing the recent volatility in crude oil markets and how that's been impacting uh, on petrochemicals. Rob, there's been a lot of volatility with crude oil in the past six months. Obviously, that's having a huge effect. Um, but what has caused that volatility? Well, the expectations of the uh, Iranian material coming to the market. This has already been priced into the market it, it, to some extent. We've seen the drops in the last six months. The uncertainty surrounding when the actual product's going to arrive at the market and what's going to happen with the US production, is it going to be cut further? What are the Iranian, what are the Saudi Arabians and the Russians going to do? All causing uh, uncertainty in the marketplace. Uh, and so we're going to continue to see some volatility for the next few months, I'm sure. Well, thank you, Rob. And in your opinion, what needs to change before we'll get much more of a stable market and more stable uh, conditions? That's a very good question. Um, I think when the Iranians do get back to the market and we see that product coming into the market, there will be some bit more stability. Oil will always fluctuate. Um, the question is, will the Saudi Arabians and Russians actually fix their production at January levels, whether that agreement stays, and whether there will be further falls in the US production levels from last year. Thank you very much, Rob. For ISIS here in London, I'm Mark Victory.